Lafayette Institute, a community correctional organization, hosting a week-long workshop at the Jack Hayward Gymnasium to equip stakeholders, community leaders, and various government agencies with the necessary tools needed to help at-risk youth. District Superintendent of Education Ivan Butler thanking its members for the work they are doing. Institute has a vision for every at-risk youth and offender to become a community leader and a model citizen. It also has added as its mission to build pathways from recovery to leadership at at-risk offenders in their communities. This vision from the LEAD Institute clearly aligns with our mission in the Ministry of Education, and that is to provide all children in the Bahamas with the opportunity to receive a quality education that will equip them with the necessary skills, knowledge, and attitudes that required for life. Senator the Honorable Kirkland Russell giving remarks on behalf of the Minister for Grants Bahama. He says the LEAD Institute's mandate is in line with the Davis administration's blueprint for change. It is our blueprint for change. The Davis administration is committed to assisting the most vulnerable in our society and we pledge not to leave behind those who felt disheartened and disenfranchised. We must all work together to recover, rebuild, and revolutionize our country. Hence, I pledge my, as well as our Minister of Grand Bahama, support and effort of the League Institute.